So here's my AK90 key programmer. I spent the last couple of evenings trying to read the EWS file uh, from the EWS module from the E39. Um, not been having any luck. Keep getting the pin no touch error, but I finally solved it. It was all down to the chip socket. Uh, it's cheap rubbish. Um, one of the um, cables on the ribbon connector uh, was not connected properly to the board. So I've just put a little bypass wire on there and connected directly to the pin that it's supposed to be connected to. Um, I did find this blog online, uh, which I will link in the description below, uh, which gave me the pinouts uh, for the chip socket to the uh, connector that goes into the AK90 unit. So I simply tapped that out. I've got a paper clip on a crocodile clip lead, connected that to my multimeter. Put the paper clip in each pin on the connector and work through to the uh, pins on the on the back of the socket here uh, until I found one that wasn't connected through. And as I say, it was down to uh, the ribbon cable here not being soldered onto the back of the board. Uh, so this bypass cable uh, did the trick just fine. Another common problem that people have is uh, the conformative coating that's on these boards. Uh, you do have to clean the actual chip up quite well. I used a Stanley knife blade uh, to scrape the coating off. It does come off quite easily but you do have to sort of persevere one pin at a time uh, to get it nice and clean. At first I thought that was my problem. I spent quite a lot of time getting this this coating off but um, it turns out that wasn't the issue after all. So I uh, thought I'd share this in case anyone else is having the same problem. Um, yeah, good luck.